We have made a robotic snake which is inspired from nature in terms of its locomotion and multiple degree of freedom to access to tightly packed volumes that humans and machinery cannot. We created a mathematical equation that control all the servo to move in a linear path. There is a camera in the front of a robot and the lidar sensor and there was lights also. Uh, this is actually sine wave traversing motion. This is sine wave horizontal and vertically. This is tunnel wave in motion. implemented this automated hydroponic system. As the temperatures go above the threshold that we have set up in our ESP32, the sprinklers will be on and maintaining all the temperatures here. As the humidity threshold goes up, the uh, exhaust fan will be controlled. The uh, humidity we have seen here, the, the TDS will be measured. The All the nutrients will be provided as per the TDS only. So here is the continued flow of nutrients and water through this uh, uh, inlets and here we have one outlet here as we can see and this is a nutrient pump we have integrated here. We have solar battery backup also for continuous power resumption. Our approach is to uh, build a smart camera. It will be predicting crime and these crime data will be logged in a central user interface. The model detects crime in the first video as assault. And the, similar, the same is updated on the database. With this crime detection model, we are using a human validation mechanism, which, which will be used to validate the uh, instances and improve the model. Sometimes the model disclassifies the video. So here we, the, we can approve or disapprove the video. So as you can see here, let's say I have approved the video. The video will be passed under the approved bucket, which will show the approved status. Also, in the disapproved status, you get the option according to the classes of the crime. We are providing the ultrasonic sensors and we are covering the uh, range of distance to detect the obstacle. This is the lower, lower one array and this is uh, at the angle of 15 degree from the from the vertical. These two arrays are complementing to each other to cover the entire area efficiently. Another ultrasonic sensor is present so that it can cover the top area. So this is the control part of that project which will take the input as an ultrasonic sound wave and then convert it to the hearable sound which is passing through the ear. This project is used for the efficient weed cutting with the help of AIM camera. This structure has two pivot points that can work on uneven terrains with ease. This cutter cuts the weeds that are in the way. This decomposition solution is sprayed via this flat fan nozzle and that is attached to a servo motor that can rotate up to 180 degrees. This camera is integrated with AIML software that has been integrated in Raspberry Pi that has also been attached to an Arduino. Its main work is to scan the environment where there is a disaster or something. This is the camera that is the visible light camera. And this is the depth perspection that we are seeing. And it is using this infrared laser array and this depth sensor here. This is the color coding pattern of this. If some object is near to the sensor, then it just gets to blue. And the farther it goes, it just get to red and no infrared uh, is getting reflected, then it's just presenting in black. We are just getting the overall map of the area. The product mainly deals with uh, patients uh, who have faced rehabilitation regarding hand and arm injuries. So this is the pen that we have designed. It is hexagonal in shape as per recommended by doctors and it is thicker in grip due to uh, uh, lesser grip strength of patients. So this is our uh, reading that we are able to generate in real time. We also provide handwriting analysis using ML modules and these are the progress reports generated in real time with our data. Here, you, as you can see, there is a bounding box formed around every word and it will recognize it. So whenever the user will see that any alphabet which is wrongly identified, he or she can correct it and improve upon their handwriting accordingly. This is an IoT-based automated hydroponic system which uses te IoT technology to grow plants without the use of soil. The first part of automation are the lights and the main pump in there. These two things are controlled by the Arduino microcontroller. There is already water present in this channel which contains nutrients for these plants. There is an IoT surface through which the owner of the system can monitor and control his system through his device from anywhere.
Our project enhances the traceability and transparency of products on the entire life cycle of a dairy supply chain. This is the web interface for collection center data entry. Here we will create a new batch of dairy product and we will add the dairy record. After that, we will have to sign the transaction from our own wallet. Similarly, for manufacturing, for the logistics part and the details will be stored in the blockchain. To access the information, we have to scan the QR code on a packet of milk. We will go on the URL and we will enter the batch number and click on get supply chain. Now you can see all the details that we have entered in different stages of the supply chain. problem statement was devising an affordable and accessible solution to help the disabled people navigate. AlphaSense 1.0 is equipped with four ultrasonic sensors, two in the front and two in the back. These ultrasonic sensors are connected to four corresponding LRA vibration motors. These vibration motors vibrate according to the distance sensed by the ultrasonic sensors. The circuit is powered by a rechargeable battery of 7.4 volt. The radium strips installed on the jacket act as an indicator for the surrounding people and vehicles. जो मार्केट में ट्रेडिशनल मशीन आते हैं तो उसमें एक फ्लाई व्हील होता है जो ट्रैक्टर के चलने से जमीन से टकरा के घूमता है और ये जो यहाँ पे गेयर्स लगे हैं उसको घुमाता है बरसात के मौसम में जमीन गीली होने की वजह से ट्रैक्टर के टायर जो है ना वो स्लिप हो जाते हैं जो वो जो व्हील है वो घूमता नहीं था उस मैकेनिकल व्हील को डायरेक्टली इलिमिनेट कर दिया है और उसकी जगह पे ये स्टेपर मोटर को अटैच किया हुआ है हमने ये हमारा एच सिस्टम है जो की पी से कंट्रोल होता है इसमें हमने बटन दिए हुए है यहाँ पर सोयाबीन को क्लिक करने के बाद में सोयाबीन सेलेक्ट हो जाएगा और यहाँ से हम उसकी स्पीड सेलेक्ट कर सकते हैं ये हमारे सीड का गियर है जिसके अंदर हमारे सीड कंटेन होंगे और वो ड्रॉप होंगे those who are visually impaired or those who have memory problems they face several difficulties in their daily life in identifying people the solution to that is a guided assistance system we have uh, used the rpi 0w microcontroller along with its camera module i have stored my friends face images in the database so when my friend comes in front of me the camera will click his picture and then it will prompt me through a bluetooth speaker or earplug that i am wearing Agrogison app uh, makes the life easier for the farmer. So I will just upload an image of my backyard crop. So I will just write uh, describe this image. A close-up image of the corn plant instead with a fall army. It will provide you precaution if uh, I want this seed. Okay, uh, I will select how much kilo. I want one kg. Okay, I will do add to cart. I will get the payment here. I will check it out. I want to sell a tomato. I will sell tomato. How much kilo? Five kilo. Per kilo. 20 rupees and it will submit if you want to upload upload the image that's it we are giving option also video also